What is up and is going on guys, Simpsy here, and welcome to another episode of my FIFA 15 Newcastle United crew mode. In today's episode, we have two huge matches, the first of which is the quarterfinals in the Champions League, and we got drawn against... God, I can't believe this. None other, none other, none other than Barcelona. So we've got them in the quarters. We were so, so lucky in the round of 16 to get drawn against Marisha Mucin Gladbach, who, let's be fair, they're not a very strong sort of squad. I don't want to shit on their fans, but uh, we were quite comfortably had a 5 0 victory. But now we have Barcelona, so uh, it's going to be very interesting to see how this goes. Um, but guys, we also have a match against Manchester City later on in the episode as well. Just want to quickly recap the last episode for you guys. Unfortunately, we ended up losing 2-1 against Chelsea. And uh, the only man to score for us was none other than the former Chelsea player, Matic, which was quite interesting. In the 90th minute, he celebrated like a mong. <laughs> but obviously, we ended up winning 2-0 over Borussia. And it was a quite, quite decent result. But the other quarterfinals going on in the Champions League... Uh, Manchester City versus Manchester United, so there's a, a, a Manchester derby going on. But before we get into that, we started off strong. We managed to make it 1-0 against Barca. Uh, Adele's right running down the wing, manages to whip it into Jovetic. But to be quite honest, I think that was short-lived, and Messi manages to do, do my defense just before the 25th minute to make it 1-1 in Barca's way. But the other um, quarters going on is Chelsea versus Real Madrid. And uh, Benfica versus Borussia Dortmund. Like, why can't we have got drawn against Benfica? At least we would have had a chance. Remy Cabela, I don't know what he's doing. He managed to split the defense. And uh, Bravo was just a little bit out of position. That ball was really dipping and diving. He managed to break away. But in the rain, up in the tomb, was very a sloppy sort of football. Antonio Greatsman there manages to let the player go past. Nice little skill move. Tries to feed it to Jovetic, but the Barcelona goalkeeper was on par. Neymar manages to feed it back to David Alaba. Alba, sorry, not Alaba. <laughs> but it was just, yeah, there wasn't much in it. Barcelona were dominating me. They were getting into some very dangerous positions. They probably should be more than 1-1 uh, one, one, one at the moment. But Rakitic manages to intercept. But look at the counter-attack here from Barca. Manages to find Luis Suarez. He hits it. But what a save from Langerak. He was really keeping us in here. Nasri manages to find Bartra. And uh, I was really <laughs> I was really quite luckily 1-1. Uh, but uh, this was on me, guys. We, we we're most likely going to be drawing against Barca. I do the stupid thing. Feed it to Luis Suarez. And he capitalized on that. So what are you going to do? You win some, you lose some. You make a mistake here and there. And that's the first time I've done this. And I was just absolutely gutted with myself. We were 1-1 against Barca. Adele Trout manages to whip it into Jovetic. He couldn't quite get up on the header. And we end up losing 2-1 against Barca. So I guess scoring a goal against Barca, we kept some humility. We kept them 1-0 down for a little bit. But it was all me. And to make things worse, Yang and Biwa managed to pick up a injury for three games. But speaking of the Champions League, it's good to see, what, what is it, four English teams in the quarterfinals. Manchester City, Manchester United, and Chelsea and me, of course. So it's going to be very interesting to see who um, wins the Champions League. But guys, let me know in the comments who do you think is going to win the league. And also, let me know who's going to win the Champions League. Uh, and let me know where I'm going to end up as well. But a day from uh, Crystal Palace is looking quite on form. Uh... Diego Costa scoring a couple of goals against me. But we do have a match against Manchester City here. And uh, this is going to be a very interesting match, to say the least. They're currently sitting in fifth. So you'd be thinking a team like Manchester City would be making top four. Yeah, we are currently leading the Barclays Premier League. But guys, if you are enjoying this FIFA 15 Manchester United career mode... Manchester United? I don't know what... I always... <laughs> Newcastle United career mode. Make sure to leave a like. I would really appreciate it. I do put a lot of effort into these videos, and a simple like would really go a long way. But Jovetic nearly starts off the scoring against his former Manchester City club, does the scoop turn, and manages to start off the scoring, which is quite... It's quite fantastic just to score after half-time against his former club, and he's celebrating like a Newcastle United player, which is absolutely fantastic. Does it with the scoop turn, and absolutely buries it here, and buries it past Joe Hart into the bottom right to make it 1-0. So, let's just reflect on the match against Barca. We had some good shots here and there. It was just basically my fault, to be quite frank. But we do manage to bring off Lasova fresh off the bench. He manages to find Jovetic, 
and he manages to chop past Nastatic and makes it 2-1. And I bet you at this point in time, Manuel Pellegrini was really, really <laughs> gutted to see Jovetic go and makes it 2-0, the captain of Newcastle. And what a successful career Jovetic has had. Hits it past Joe Hart to make it 2-0 against Manchester City. They were, they were really quite strong in the first half. The first half was uh, pretty even, to be honest, but we managed just to run away in this match. Jovetic managed to find Wellington Silver fresh off the bench, and he scores his first goal of the Premier League in a Newcastle United jumper in the 80th minute. Makes it 3-0 against City, and Jovetic manages to pick up an assist. He was just absolutely on fire in this match. So we're currently 3-0 up at home against Manchester City, and they were just playing absolutely subpar. <laughs> Wellington Silver fresh off the bench, and uh, guys, this is not going to be the last of it. Suzoko manages... Us yeah, Suzuko manages to find Wellington Silver. Wellington Silver with a Ronaldo shot manages to find Jovetic. He gets brought down, but he still managed to get the shot off to score his hat trick. And he scores a hat trick against his former club, Manchester City. So we're exceptionally lucky there to get up there, to get the scoring up there. But guys, thank you very much for watching if you watched all the way through. I really do appreciate it. And remember to go and have a fantastic rest your day after you've watched this video. I will, as always, be bringing out more FIFA 15 career mode tomorrow for you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Simpsy out.